Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer is not detecting your HDMI or 4K TV. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the search menu. And you want to type in settings. Best result should come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, you want to select display, so go ahead and select the display tile. And then on the right side, you want to scroll down and select where it says multiple displays. Choose the presentation mode for your displays, so click inside of there. And now where it says detect other display, select the detect button. And if you have any other displays hooked up, you would want to make sure they're hooked up at this time, obviously, and select detect. And then hopefully that should be able to resolve the problem here as well. At this point, you can close out of there. If you're still having an issue, you can go open up the search menu and type in projection. Best match to come back with projection settings. Go ahead and open that up. And now, if you had any devices, you want to make sure you have Miracast first. So make sure you go ahead and download and install it if you didn't have it. But anyway, at this point, be able to hopefully go ahead and actually project to a monitor or television, depending on what the device is being recognized as. So you can go ahead and do that as well. And that's just another option to explore. And it also never hurts to actually restart your computer as well and then attempt to reconnect your devices. It's definitely worth a try here to consider. And then hopefully your issue should have been resolved if you then attempt to connect your TV. But hopefully it should already be detected at this point. So as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.